oh my god, that Reddit user G Steph has been back to Cushion Library and as they do, uncovering some nice little juicy tidbits for us about George R. R. Martin's works. Cushion Library has like two hundred boxes of George R. R. Martin's drafts, manuscript pages, fan mail, you know, all sorts of correspondence and things. And it has uncovered some some little golden nuggets before. And yeah. Thank you, G Steph, for going back and providing us this lovely Reddit Reddit post that we're gonna read through now. So the first thing they point out is the murder of John Aaron originally. Guess who? Guess who is behind it? Go on. Yeah, it's Cersei. I love Cersei. She's a mad bitch. Um, of course she would have been behind it. I like that it was changed to Lysa Aaron because, you know. It just adds more mystery to it. Everyone's gonna assume it's fucking Cersei. And they do also, well, actually, I think it's a commenter further down that points out that, well, Cersei is kind of responsible for John Aaron's death. She and um, the maester are not really helpful. It's worth going through and reading this yourself because they have literally provided us a passage that's, you know, the original version and then the published version that points out a few differences in a conversation Brown overhears between Cersei and Jamie, And, yeah, obviously, points out who masterminds the uh, John Aaron murder. The second thing he points out is a much darker character for Ned. In the story that we have now, Catelyn arrests Tyrion at the Inn on the Crossroads. They go off up to the Eyrie. And, you know, Tyrion is Catelyn's prisoner. In the original story, Ned was the one that gave the order to arrest Tyrion there, which gives him a bit more political prowess in the story, whereas we see him as a bit dumb to it. Another change that they found is that Ned apparently had a bit more of a potty mouth. Instead of saying to Arya after Micah's death that Sandor did it for the, you know, the cruel woman he serves, apparently, originally, he said, you know, he did it for the bitch he serves. Go, Ned. I think they could have kept that. But, well, no, it's totally Ned to say cruel woman. There is a lot of details in this post. You really just got to go and read it for yourself. A couple of other small ones that stand, you know, well, and they don't stand out to me. They're just, I like them. Arya's wolf was supposed to be called Nymerion, um, which is a warrior witch of Valyria. Badass still. Um, Renly and Stannis were supposed to be, you know, residing in, in you know, Swapsies. And, uh, yeah, Ned and Robert's father were both supposed, you know, both of their fathers were supposed to be, you know, have been killed by errors in the same way. But it seems like that was obviously only then Ned's father. Yeah, there is a lot. Oh, and they've also taken a picture of the early, earliest maps, which, you know, for Westeros, it, it's pretty still accurate. They haven't changed much. There is a whole bunch of stuff in this in this post. You just go and read it, go and read it. The link's below. Cheerio. PS, PS, PS. We will, we, sh- we will, of course, be going into more of what's in this post, but it's just a lot. So I didn't want to do a really long video and make it, you know, be overwhelmed by it. Uh, we don't often get, you know, information, new information, So, yeah, go read the article, enjoy, and we'll come back and and discuss. Bye.